Hello everyone. Learn to get down on your knees and pray. If you are living or trying to live for Jesus Christ, I believe you may encounter times when you may feel or notice a demonic presence or some things that may be demonic. Now you may panic and not really know what to do. For instance, myself, sometimes <laughs> there are times, and this may seem like I am nuts or crazy or whatever else you want to say, but if you want to think that, that is your choice. I am sane. But there are times where I feel like I am not the only one in my room. And this is not always the case, but sometimes I can feel a very evil presence in my room and sometimes worse than that maybe one or two hours earlier around there i was feeling an urgency to pray like as if something was not so much telling me i guess i can say telling me but like a urgency to pray and um, before that, too, I believe I was feeling a demonic presence as if I am not the only one in my room. But, you know, I guess when I felt it at first, I didn't really want to pray. There came a time to where maybe I was feeling somewhat of an urgency back then, but let's say at a particular time i was feeling like uh, more of an urgency i would say to pray and um i think i prayed over an hour and towards the end of it towards the end of my prayer it felt like the atmosphere of my room changed like right now there is more peace at the time before i started praying i think when i went to the bathroom i would pray i prayed a little bit i think there was times when i would pray a little bit but i would still feel that demonic presence but until i got down on my knees and started to pray like now i am feeling peace right now before you know certain images some images come to my mind now but i think it was more so before i got down on my knees and prayed if i am saying this correctly you need to learn to pray when demonic forces are coming your way I don't see how anyone can live without Jesus Christ's help. Like, when it comes down to marriage, when it comes down to living in this life, how can you live without the help of Jesus Christ? Honestly, I don't know how it is possible. I don't know.
but I believe many people have felt a demonic presence before. And you don't have to stay in fear. You don't have to. Begin praying to Jesus Christ. God, please forgive me for all of my sins. Any sins in me, God, please forgive me. I bind and cast out any demon that is in my house, my room, around me. I lose protection all around me. I believe there are scriptures where I don't have it on me. Something about angels in caps around people who serve God or something like that. I don't have the scripture on me. Start quoting biblical scriptures and stuff like that. If you have them in mind, when I feel a demonic presence like that, like the way it was, I usually will, sometimes I will begin playing. Uh, there is a person I listen to. I think he is, YouTube's name is Dappy T. Keys. And he plays uh, piano, gospel, instrumentals. I think he is very anointed. Very anointed, I believe. I think if he has an album, I might buy it. I don't know. I like his music. And I put his uh, music on. And I begin praying. I can say this. Now, I'm not sure if it is in the Bible. I'm not sure. But I think I heard more than one person say, whenever you get like so many demonic attacks, that can be a sign that you are close to to a breakthrough now i don't know if that is true or not but if it is true <laughs> i hope the breakthrough comes soon because i can say this the number of attacks i go through it is shocking very shocking i guess yeah it is shocking you know, some people may go through more attacks than me, but I tell you this, hopefully the breakthrough comes soon. But the main point I am making this video is learn to get down on your knees and pray to Jesus Christ. Like, I think for a while when I was praying, I was not feeling the amount of peace that I am feeling now. So when that happens, I keep on praying. Most times I keep on praying. I keep on praying. I keep on praying. Then when I start to feel more peace or around the peace I am feeling now, I may stop. But don't be don't succumb am i using that word right don't when you feel demonic stuff like that you may have to stop what you are doing and begin praying to god and you may ask me kevin how do i pray well how do you talk to a person talk to jesus christ as you would talk to me ask him for help you know, you may not know much scriptures about God. Talk to him as if you would talk to me. Ask him for help. Ask him to do this for you. Ask him to do that for you. Then as you grow more in knowledge of God, I believe you'll be more, I guess I can say, prepared to know how to pray better. But you have to start from somewhere. So.
So let me stop here. May God bless you.